Good morning, everyone. I'm Richard Todd. This is Todd Productions and comic book and video games. We will be discussing about uh, uh, yeah, something new game this morning and a bit of a, uh, a surprise, an opportunity says, to be an executive producer for uh, another production. He says, yes, I've worked with the guy before. He says, mm -hmm. he's in Hungarian and uh, I think that he, he wants me to be attached to it. He says, yeah, that's not bad. He says, yeah, I don't have to look through everything that he sent. So, okay, first of all, last week I got two of them. I didn't really want to uh, talk about it for, uh, because, one, uh, yeah, I will show you what I got the first the first two one came this morning. So, that, by the way, I've never seen that. It's just, and uh, I've, I've watched it and thoroughly enjoyed it. It's just, yeah. That's before the I, it is. It says, uh, yeah, it's the entire series. This is season. It says, wow. It says, <laughs> that's kind of cool. It says, so I'm very good at having that. As of the opportunity, I think it would be a lot better uh, that I uh, do it because one, uh, executive producer. That'd be kind of cool. It's not as expensive. It's only two hundred and fifty dollars. Says, uh, yeah, that's pretty cool. Says, I think I might grab it instead of actually getting more of these. Says, <laughs> says it'd probably be best if I did it that way. Says, I could probably get because after I do that, then I can get maybe two more. Uh, um, Power Ranger, yeah, they're not, they're not expensive as long as you do it right. Just, exactly. So that's the only thing I just wanted to talk about an uh, opportunity. I may grab it or may not. I have no idea. And to get my name out there a bit more is even an added plus. Says, yeah. And if you're wondering what the other one was, it's called Spirits of the Dark. I have a thank you. Uh, uh, definite, uh, and my name's getting out there. That is the main priority. What I do, uh, yeah, help create things uh, and uh, help help people. Um, uh, talk about a little bit more to keep going. Uh, my producing credits range up to 2017. Uh, but before all, all of that, because basically it's all my stuff um, from a certain point of view, uh, I'll tell you the ones I've helped on. Uh, Barry, the Sky, Hobo, and the Clown, Fellow, Operation Elephant Ears. Uh, well, that's fine. Uh, To, you know, it, it is, but it isn't. It's just, yeah, I also wrote it. it. Says "Escape from Hell." It says uh, "Dancer and the Boy." That was the first one with, or was it the second one? But yeah, uh, Don Fields, like Massacre at Female Creek. Uh, yeah, and uh, let me see, uh, Infinity. Uh, Executive producer. So, yeah, and I have a lot of my own, uh, which I make, have been making for a long time. Yeah, I started in for producing 2012. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just going through my thing. Just, I got it. 
acting. First time I acted was in Beckenfield. Yeah, on the edge of sanity. It says, ooh, it says, and then the rest of mine. Uh, no, the uh, the non-union stuff I've been in. Uh, now they don't have. I wish they did. It would have been so much easier. This is the show that I actually have been on a lot more stuff. This is my thank yous are from. That's right. I, I don't. Uh, Don, uh, when I started working with Don, it was uh, 209, which is actually a science fiction thing. Um, that's a thank you. SOCOM, the hunt for Bigfoot, that was pretty interesting. Uh, 2016, uh, both. And she wrote uh, Anthology. A documentary and particularly was good. This is monster. Yeah, that definite. This uh, then um, spirits in the dark. This is monster and spirits of the dark were our two horror things. This is uh, yeah. This is and I get around also with uh, next door. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, God got ill. Yeah. <laughs> Not the best director, but he's actually been very good. It's just... Yesterday's Moon. Ooh, that was a good one. Uh, Love Life. Another excellent one. Uh, uh, De Grindo. Yeah. A la tamba. Yeah. I see. Yeah. So, so basically, yeah. So if I, as I said, take the opportunity, it will be even better. So, uh, yeah. So my producing credits would increase. <laughs> oh, it's just a CV. That's all it really is. You have to do your research on these things, so I have to go through the entire thing. Uh, let me see. Um, it's called "I Hear the Trees Whispering," it says, uh, and it's directed by Joseph Gallari. It's a uh, it's a Hungarian name. It says, yeah. Learning from his tormented past, the man takes a job in the middle of the woods, only to find his quiet life shattered when it soon turned out, not, out nothing around him is what it seems. Hi, my name is Joseph, an indie filmmaker. In, in Hungarian. He's a Hungarian. This, that, but also the people who know me as a writer and director of independent horror films such as a guidebook to murdering your ex because you can't really say uh, the K word uh, and uh, spirits in the dark told you <laughs> whispering the whispering of a man and the poltergeist <laughs> diaries says yeah I don't even know polar guys had diaries. Oh, well, today I scared some humans. <laughs> uh, which uh, starred uh, Academy Award nominee Eric Roberts. This, yeah, these approached me on a few things. I turned them down because one, I didn't have that kind of money. This, no, I said, I'm sorry, I can't. This, this, but always. Uh, keep me up to date. Yeah. So it goes on. I am more than excited to film my next project entitled "I Hear the Trees Whispering," a mixture of of adventure films, dramas, science fiction, and a bit of horror movies. We have particularly funding. 
particularly funding for the film and had already had the work, had the actors and some of the crew members. This time we need to push this over the top. Ah uh, well, there's Laura Saxton says so Saxon, not sex. <laughs> no way I said before. Sorry. Um, Gabor, as well, he plays uh, in the interview. Ooh, and something else. Sorry, can't pronounce it. Uh, Lara, isolation lockdown. This is, yeah, Larry Honkin. Uh, we all know him from Escape from Alcatraz, Home Alone, Breaking Bad, and Pain and Gain. He says, ooh. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah. Let me see. Who's the executive producers? Uh, Portrait Guy's Diaries. Uh, Something unpronounceable starts with a D. All heroes must die too. The last superhero. Mm, cool. Says. Says. Yeah, I know them, but I can't. There's one called John. Griggle. Uh, that. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, monster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep, yeah, that's right. The Last Scout, uh, Parvas, uh, Zabba. Says, I hope I pronounced that name right. Says, co produces uh, Spirits in the Dark, Whispering Man, Six Below, Better Bold Dog, uh, A Guide for m Murdering Your Axe. It's, it's the K word. Says, Stefan Zid uh, Jordan, uh, the Poltergeist Carries, Afro Max, the Whispering Man associate producers are John J. Jackson, uh, known for OP's Lust for Revenge, uh, Wicked Once, Violet Angel. Joseph Richmond, uh, Invasion of the Not Quite Dead. And homeless asses. Interesting. This is. <clears throat> I'm not gonna look at the cast and crew because there's the link. Uh, our goal is to release our films worldwide, bought DVD, Blu-ray, uh, limited theatrical and show an exciting twist in the field of adventure and mystery films. We have already worked with some great dis distributors that are waiting for our film. 90% of the shooting will take place in July, October, and November of 2021. Officially tra trailer is expected to be released in December. Our plan is to secure the first distributor of the film early 2022. Indeed, every motion picture comes with a great set of risks and challenges and needs a great amount of preparation and experiences to be able to properly handle them. It is more than virtual to planning things out in great detail before shooting. Therefore, delays, if it's connected to COVID-19 or for other reasons in the completion of the film or delivery of perks will be communicated with all our contributors th through updates. And underneath uh, trailers from their previous work, uh, then it's uh, at this stage we all hope you are wondering how to be involved in the film. So let's have a look at the great perks including digital goodies, private links, special relics, producer and special thank you credits in IMDB and in the film. The amount will be put in the cost of 
post-production and festival fees. All credits will be listed on IMDb right after your configuration. There are, of course, other ways you can help us. Tell your friends about the campaign. Like and share. Grab and copy our previous films, which I actually have done in, uh, yeah. Uh, might, have, might have been on a thing too, but still, that's a cool, uh, that's a good, cool way to do it. Contact the writer at, uh, 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 I'm not giving you the email. <laughs> no. It says, uh, please do not contact ask us if we need actors or just I did that in the past and I learned not to just <laughs> this yeah that's about it for that uh, and the side uh, I guess it is a go go get funding this thing this so yeah there's leap updates like balls do this and uh, <laughs> so, yeah, the donates uh, start usually about about twenty-five dollars, fifty dollars the second one, hundred dollars. Uh, that's for only for thank yous. If you go over that, that would be even be cool. Uh, Two hundred and fifty dollars or more. This is. So, or I may mean, not. I, uh, I have no idea. This is, this is. The five hundred dollar one is taken, uh, and it goes up to a thousand. Just well, three thousand. <laughs> Sorry. I don't have a thousand nor three thousand. Says. So I have to go to the first one. Uh, yeah, two fifty. Yeah. And two more of these, or I may, or if I don't, that's quite right. Then I can get more of our ranges. So yeah. So sorry, I had a itch. This so. What do you think what I should do? Get more of these or help out these wonderful people? Says yes. Because if you, if I do that, then I have to be limited to this. It'll be the last time I do anything uh, for uh, yeah for for producing for a while. So yeah. So I would be active, uh, actively uh, involved in uh, stuff. So anyway, you know who I am. Thank you for listening. And I, have, yeah, I got 70, uh, wait, what was it? No, I got um, 74 um, days left. It's over a month. This is way over a month. So I don't have to do it right away. Uh, 18th, hold on. So if I do it, okay, when it happens, do it. So I got two, because on the 13th, would be Thursday. Uh, yeah, I think it might be fine. It's just yeah, just have to be careful. Just, yeah, so if I do that, I'll probably, probably be the only thing I do. It's just, I may not even get any of the power ranges. Just, because what I can do, I actually can get power ranges in England, but it won't be for a while. So, yeah. So then I will have to get a DVD thing that uh, that takes um, regional. So yeah. 
free, like in all free regional uh, meaning, I would be able to watch uh, the thing. So I have my own this uh, new ones in uh, there. Just I think it'll be a good idea. Just I think I may just like it's a feature film. Uh, so and it looks like I think I think this one, it looks like a. Um, I don't take a look at it. Just, anyway, have a good day, everyone.